Hi guys, welcome to Steve Strings. Steve Girardi here. Today I have a little DIY project for you. Today I'm going to show you how you can turn these, that is say gift cards or credit cards, into these, which are guitar picks. If you want to see how I do it, stick around. All right guys, I'd like to start off by showing you just sort of a sampling of some of the picks that I have made by uh, making picks from gift cards or credit cards. Um, and I should say that, of course, these two are HEB gift cards. For those of you who aren't from Texas, uh, HEB is a local um, a grocery store chain. It's quite popular. Over here, these orange ones you can see are from Whataburger. That's also a, a Texas chain, as is Bill Miller Barbecue I have here. You can also see I have some Marriott uh, keys here. These were from Marriott Hotel Room Keys. And this is from an old credit card. And this is from an AARP uh, membership card. This pick is from Tractor Supply Company. This is from Schlotsky's Olive Garden. And of course, the ubiquitous Starbucks. Uh, so basically, my process here is to find, start off with by finding a pick that you like. For example, here's a pick I picked up at Sam Ash, or here's a Daddario pick. Find some pick you like, and you can trace it. Now, if you want to be able to center your pick um, on a piece of art, you either want to use a pick that you can see through, like this one here from Straight Music in Austin, or you can take a pick that you like, say here's a Daddario pick, and this was just a clear piece of plastic from some packaging, and I basically just cut that out, um, and I used this clear piece so I can lay it on top of whatever credit card or gift card, and I can see through this material in order to, to trace it out. Uh, so that's basically the starting point. Uh, in order to trace these, um, what I do is I take a, a fine pointed uh, felt tip pen and I just take uh, a pick that I like, again one that I can see through, and I'll just lay it down right on top of the card just like that. And I should say that all the skills you need to do this uh, you learned in kindergarten when you learned how to trace things and you learned how to cut out things with scissors because that's really all you do. So basically what you do is you just hold that uh, translucent or see-through pick um, in place where you want it to be, and then you just trace it out with this pen. And then you take it and you take your scissors and you, and you cut as close to that line as you can. Uh, once you have the, the pick um, kind of roughed out, and again, try to cut as close to the line that, that you, you cut, then I take uh, like a nail file or a um, one of those um, uh, emery boards for like, you know, filing your nails. And you basically just trim it up and get it smooth. And if you need to, you then just round the edges. Um, in addition to using uh, credit cards or gift cards, you can also use things like uh, CDs or any other material. In fact, uh, this pick here was a, a, a plastic basket. The basket broke, and so the bottom of it was flat, and so I basically just uh, cut some, some of these thicker, sturdy picks out of the bottom of a, a, a plastic basket. But that's basically the process. You basically just trace out uh, what it is you want to cut out. You then cut it out with scissors, and then you get like an emery board or a file or something and get the edges smooth and you've got all the picks you could ever want. Now, I should say that um, I'm doing this because I make cigar box guitars and so if I'm gonna make the guitar, I might as well make the things that go with it, such as picks. So once I make a bunch, I can use things like these um, uh, like pill bottles to store them in or you can use these little uh, mint uh, containers to store them in, like these Altoid mint containers. You can store them as well. And this is one that I use. It's a little Tic Tac bottle. Once I was done with the Tic Tacs, I just filled it up with picks that I made. And plainly, I have more picks than I need, uh, but they're fun to make. 
Uh, I should say that uh, my plan right now for all these picks, or some of these picks anyway, is to give some away. So this is a heads up that I'll be doing a collaboration with Kale from Pornish Studios. We're gonna be doing a giveaway, giving away an instrument and some other things, including some of these picks. I'm also gonna be showing how I make my uh, bottleneck slides. I'll be giving those away as part of that giveaway. I'm also going to be making a stomp box as well and maybe some other things. But uh, So keep an eye out because I'm going to be giving away some of these picks as part of this big, bigger giveaway that's coming up in the next couple weeks. So stay tuned. I hope this video has shown you that uh, making picks from gift cards or credit cards is really very simple. Again, you just lie them on, trace them out cut them out, and then smooth the edges. Uh, if you'd like to win some of these picks as part of a bigger giveaway we'll be doing, uh, stay tuned for some more videos, both on my channel and also on Portis Studios. I'll leave a link here. You can check out his channel as well. Thanks for watching.